Hey everybody, we got some great news. I know you've been seeing a lot about Scribble Showdown. Our tester show went really well and we're taking it on the road. That's right, my friend Ross and I, we're going to go take our drawing show Scribble Showdown on the road. Wow, he looks cool. We're going to Anaheim, Boston, Brooklyn, Austin, San Francisco, Seattle, Portland. If you're in any of those cities or nearby, go check to see tickets in the description right now. They're going on sale this week, so check it out. Check out that link and come to get Scribble Showdown. Here's a trailer on how that first show went. But boom you guys all ready to participate? Yeah. Scribble Showdown, this is a game show. And whoever wins is going to receive the championship belt. <laughs> On your marks, get set, draw! <laughs> Points deducted, <laughs> points deducted. <laughs> Who can come up with a hero? Come on up. Come on. Do you have a favorite video game character? Uh, I'm gonna have to go with Genji from Overwatch. Oh, what the hell's Sorry. going on? <laughs> Did your Genji have some kind of accident? <laughs> the first ever Scribble Showdown champion belts goes to... I'm Grump, I'm not so Grump, and we're the Game Grumps! Why, hello there. What's up, shiggity schwiggity schwaz? God, you're so schwiggity today. <laughs> I'm feeling the schwiggityness. You better be, because it's here. <laughs> <laughs> God, it's now! <laughs> <laughs> this is content! <laughs> <laughs> oh, goodness. Um, I gotta go into Castletown. Okay. Yeah. Let's do it. I gotta, I gotta... I just gotta run. I don't know. Yeah, just... Put this guy's in your way! Nuh-uh. <laughs> <laughs> no! Not like this! He doesn't know anything about my steez! <laughs> Wait! I wanted to learn something about your steez! Ah, uh, shit. Uh... <laughs> I'm gonna get him! I'm gonna... Ah, oh, shit! <laughs> Goodbye! Okay. I found El Wolfo. What over here? I hope. Oh, there he is. What's up, El Wolfo? Yeah, man. What's up, dude? Mm. Oh, oh, I need to get my sword and bork to the top of that funky jam. I can't bork over there. Oh God, what are you talking about? I can't bork over it's top of that borkage. funky jam. Ah, um, man, I know there's so much borkage ahead of me. Hold on, got to deal with these assholes again. <laughs> yeah. Uh, oh God. Ah, oh, shit. Ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> yeah, why aren't they ever stunned or injured from their m drops? Because they're fucking assholes, dude. Well, I hadn't considered that thought. You gotta consider all the angles. Especially when it involves a dangle. Oh, well, it's directly proportional. To the heat of me. Oh, you know I know those facts. Because uh -huh. you taught them to me. You're the master and I'm the student. But soon, the student will become the teacher. What, are you gonna kill me? Yeah? I gotta absorb your power somehow. Yeah, well, alright, fine. You're welcome to try. But I swear to God, if you defeat me in battle, I will suck your dick! <laughs> <laughs> alright, <laughs> sorry. I promise we'll stop doing that soon. Oh, yeah. It's just, we're, we've been in a mood. We've been in a mood. It's the new, um... Uh... Bubble Zoo. What was the one we always said? Hi Chica. Hi Chica. Yeah, oh god, we did say that for a long time. Yeah, people were as, as soon as way into it. As soon as something like as soon as you just get so used to saying something that it replaces words. Um words when your brain goes blank. Yeah. That's when you know you say some shit too much. Mm-hmm. I still love Hi Chica though. Hi Chica. However you'd spell it. Yeah. I think I think people I think it was like the accepted uh, fan way of, of spelling it was was like Hai Chi Cow. Yes, it seemed that way. Oh, what? Did you lose a bug? I lost it! Ah, oh, shit, dude! Oh, oh, there he is. Okay, thank God. Come here, you fucker! Now you'll taste the rest of the boy Wolf Mouth! Wolf Mouth? 
Wolf mouth! <laughs> nice. Bite you, now you're dead. Excellent. What do you want? What's going hey, on? what's going on? There should be one more. Where could the last tear be? Tear. Maybe you should check your eyes. <laughs> what? There it is. What's going on? This is weird. What, like this? Is that what you're talking about? I don't know. I, mean, I guess I'll just go back there. I'm like wasting my time running around town all fucking lost and shit. Like, I'm a little puppy, man. You didn't waste your time. You got the bug. Where'd my bone go? You had to give it up the moment you picked it up. Like, it disappeared as soon as the screen changed. That's such bullshit, man! Why can't I just walk around this whole entire game with a fucking bone in my mouth? Like, if I'm a puppy, I want to live the life. Aaron, if you're gonna walk around this town with a bone in your mouth, it should be mine. Hell yeah, dude. <laughs> Hell yeah. Just- just saying, just- just thinking out loud. <laughs> I'm just thinking out loud in a way that would influence you to act a certain way. <laughs> that I want you to act. Yes. And perform a behavior that I would appreciate. <laughs> Like sucking. Okay. Okay. <laughs> and we're done. I gotta go back to the Hylian, <laughs> the Hylian lake. I'd love it if, like, the way you had carrots for Epona, if you just had like little biscuits <laughs> for yourself, <laughs> little Scooby snack. Yeah. Aww. I feel like I've talked about this on the show before, but I really want to reiterate how much it fucking pissed me off. Okay. There's a snack out there. That is a Scooby-Doo branded snack. Mm-hmm. They are shaped like dog biscuits. Okay. And you can buy them and eat them in- in big boxes. Right. What do you think those snacks would be called? I would call them Scooby Snacks. Right. Okay. What they're actually called is Scooby-Doo Graham Cracker Snacks. Oh boy. Did they- did they make do graham cracker really small lettering? No. Oh. It, well, I mean, it's like the Scooby-Doo logo, right? Yes. And then, yeah, it's, then it says graham cracker snacks or graham cracker treats or whatever underneath. You fucking believe that shit? It's- it's an outrage. What the it's, hell is wrong with people? It's the greatest outrage of my or any of our lives. Like, kiss my rump, dude. <laughs> Suck my donk, bonch. <laughs> yeah, I- I don't know. I don't get it. Uh... Did you bring it up with the manager of your local Target? I got a little flippant with him, I'm not gonna lie. Did you? Oh, yeah! I t I it's took definitely that his fault. I took that man aside and I said, if you're gonna support brands, why don't you support a brand that helps the environment? And I gave him like a pamphlet what? about bees and shit. <laughs> Is it true that if all the bees die, we lose- we lose strawberries, avocados, and coffee. Well, like, more than that. Oh, it's such a bummer. We lose almonds, first of all. Oh, uh, well, they're bad anyway, right? No. Like, fuck them, right? Suck <laughs> <laughs> That whole thing? Yeah, I remember, Aaron. So, was it right here? Is it- is it talking about this thing? I think so. I don't know what else would be- It was pointed, like, right here, so maybe yes. we should go right there. Okay. It'd be such a silly little pig. Yeah, but dude, no pollinate. We would lose most of our foods, dude. Really? Yeah, man. You gotta fucking pollinate that shit. A lot of our foods are made of their flower fruits and shit. Mmm. And you can't pollinate flowers without bees. I mean, that's you can, a, but that's a bummer. Pain in the ass. Let's all try to reduce our carbon footprint, shall we? Well, let's at least try to help the fucking bees, man. Like, come on, stop being cruel to bees. There's a bee outside my house that was dying, and I was like, dude. And I gave him a little sugar. Did you give him mouth to mouth? I- I kinda. I well, gave, it'd be her, if she's a worker bee. Oh, yeah. I gave her a little spot of- little spot of sugar water, and she fucking sucked that shit down. I could see the little glob reducing. And she was just like, <laughs> hell yeah. And did she recover? Yeah, and then she started walking and flew away. Wow! That's what you gotta do. That's the trick, man. You gotta- you gotta mix up some sugar water. And, uh, put it in front of the little bee, and you'll see the little proboscis unfold, and then... Mm. What, why, why was it dying? Just out of yeah, dehydrated? Yeah, it gets out of energy, you know? It lands somewhere where it just doesn't have enough energy to fly anymore, and it just kind of is like, well, I guess this is where I die. Holy crap. That's fucked. It's a bummer. Where the hell is this last goddamn <laughs> thing?! Where's this insect so I can kill it?! <laughs> I mean, fucking right?! I, I got a guide. I got yeah. the guide. Opening it up. Oh, boy. Make your way over to- one more insect. Swim on over 
in the shadow and what? <laughs> what? Yeah, I guess it, it maybe if it says swim on over, then maybe it's the green dot. Feed it. There's number shadow insects right in the middle. What the fuck? Just go to the green dot, you whore. Well, I can't go to the green dot. What do you think? I'm a fucking idiot. Like I can't go there. I've been trying. Are you sure you can't? Yeah, the fucking boxes are gone, so I can't jump over the edge of the damn thing. <laughs> Look, see, this is how I got down here. Remember, there was right. a fire. I do remember that. And then there's this, there's this spot right here, but I, I can't get up there I guess unless the fire, I have the boxes. The fire consumed the boxes. The fire burned the boxes. All right, we better pause this. I think maybe it's if I cross the bridge, and then go. Yeah, whatever. Okay. Pause. <laughs> oh, no, not the bees! Not the bees! Ah! <laughs> we play video games for a living. <laughs> it's amazing. I went- I went to warp to Lake Helia, and then the- the Twilight Bloat. What happened? That's what they call it. Twilight Bloat? Twilight Bloat! What does that mean? It's, uh, it's like a big-ass bug. Oh, oh. It's a big-ass bug. I thought you meant you just, like, get gassy from <laughs> walking around this world. I've got the Twilight Bloat. <laughs> Don't look at me! It's disgusting. Seriously disgusting. I'm hideous. Hideous. Mm. Is that like what Hideo considers himself when he's like, looks in the mirror? What the hell are you talking Hideo about? Hideo Kojima. Uh, it's like, I'm Hideo Dio. I thought you meant Hideo Nomo, the, uh, the baseball pitcher. Oh, is he good? He's not. No? Not anymore. Um, he was in the 90s. Is he dead? He's not. Oh. But his career is? I think so. Oh, poor Hideo. I mean, he's old. Well, I mean... <laughs> he doesn't love the game any less. That's true. Athletes die two deaths, they say. Oh, wow. Yeah, one when you retire and one when you actually die. And then the other when the last person forgets your name. <laughs> Sorry, I just... And then the third death. <laughs> the death of spirit. <laughs> when you live for 10,000 years in the spirit realm. Wow. All right, I got it. Ah! <laughs> Hello. Really? The Twilight Bloat. The, I hate it. I kind of like it. Yeah, it's like it feels like it would give good hugs. It's like barfy, but also like squeegily. Squeegily. Yeah, it's like, but it's also like. <laughs> oh, gross! It's the not things gross. That, it's the fucking thing, beautiful. It, it's got exactly the same consistency as uh, the imprisoned toes. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, that's where they got the idea from. Maybe. Maybe the imprisoned toes is just three bloats. I wouldn't be shocked. That would fucking. Oh wait, what the fuck? This reminds me of that fight you had in Sonic Unleashed, with uh, with the giant bird. The giant bird. Yeah, where I was like, Aaron, get the third barrel. <laughs> the barrel. <laughs> I think I blacked all that out. Oh, you shouldn't have. It was uh, one of the greatest moments of my life. Wow. We gotta play the Xbox 360 version of that. Of Sonic Unleashed? Yeah. You can't be serious. Because everyone was upset that we played the Wii version, which is the inferior version, which I thought was funny. Yeah, it was really funny. Because when I, when I was asking the team, I was like, oh, what's the difference between the Xbox 360 version and the Wii version? And they were like, oh, the Wii version is like vastly inferior. And I was like, oh, so we're playing that one. Wow. Oh, yes. You, that was a conscious choice. Because so, like, because I, right? But then because people actually like Sonic, people were upset that we didn't play the good one. Right. Um. Which is understandable. Yeah. Oh. Kill him! Oh, hello. No, it, down, Aaron. What? It's like, like a stab down. I don't have a stab. Oh, all right. Just kill the... No. Yeah, just keep hitting that leg then. Maybe you have to knock them all down. Oh, do I, oh I can land in his tummy. Oh, I, got, I gotta do the fucking B thing. The B uh, thing? This thing. Oh. That makes perfect sense. Hey! Yeah. Oh, He's all noodly. Oh shit, dude. Those nipples look like they produce a lot of bug milk. That's not how bugs work, Aaron. <laughs> Says you, dude. When's Ugh. the last time you nursed on a bug? Could you imagine a live bug birth? <laughs> <laughs> Especially at that size. Although I have seen bugs essentially be born and it is super fascinating. Which bug? It was a mosquito uh, getting born out of like water. 
It's very, very strange. Oh, the like maggot thing? I, it's, well, it started as that, and this was when it was going from, from that stage to the fully formed Skeeter. Did it fly in your face and go up your nose and then take control of your brain and- NOW THAT'S THE DAN THAT YOU ARE NOW! No, it was in You're a movie, mistake. Aaron. It was in a movie. What do you mean it was in a movie? It was a documentary called, uh, Microcosmos. Oh. Yeah, very interesting movie. I've told you about it, right? So, so my theory that your mosquito man is not holding no weight? Yeah, I'm sorry, Aaron. I, as much as I hate to be the one to burst that bubble for you. <laughs> yeah. Uh, no, I haven't heard of this film. I- I feel like I must have told you about it a hundred times. It, it's- this guy developed- this is 20 years ago already. More, maybe. Uh, this guy- <laughs> Could you please remove this from my mouth? You dropped this? <laughs> I'm the Were cartoon alligator snake! Were you kids playing ball in my yard? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's Lanayru! Yeah. Ah. I believe this belongs to you. My name is Lanayru. Your efforts have at last restored each of us light spirits in Hyrule. Oh, so they're all resurrected now? Oh, hero chosen by the gods, which is us. The dark power that you seek. It waits in a temple set in the bed of Lake Hylia. Ooh, that sounds comfy. Yeah. <laughs> Lake Hylia is the hottest girl around. But before seeking it, you must now bear witness to something and never forget it. Check out my dick. <laughs> my dick! You must know that it was the will of the goddesses that we lock away the forbidden power. Did you know half of a snake's body is also- Whoa! Too close, man! Oh, here he is. Ah, uh, shit, dude. Now you're in space. When Very all was cool. chaos, the goddesses descended- Whoa! Look out! <laughs> into the- and gave our- oh. They granted power equally to all who dwelt in the light, and then returned to the heavens. Goodbye. Nineteen rings were split among them, and one of them to rule them all. <laughs> the lands where the goddesses descended came to be known as the Sacred Realm. Why is she there? For ages, the people... Brought you a hottie. For ages, the people lived at ease, content in mind and body. I'm here. Doing yoga like woe. But soon, word of the sacred realm spread through Hyrule, and a great ba- Whoa, uh... Why did you bring that? I'm gonna kill you! Oh, maybe not. That chick dropped her knife. And you were like, blah blah. Her titties were all like, blah. What? That wasn't the outfit I was just wearing? This is very strange. I like it, though. Okay. Among those living in the light, interlopers who excelled at magic appeared. Hi. Remember Dark Link and how fucking hard he was? Now there's three. <laughs> that sucks. Wielding powerful sorcery, they tried to establish dominion over the sacred realm. Okay. And then they said stop. In the name of love. They were doing kind of like a go team kind of thing. Before you break their hearts. What is happening right now? <laughs> I'm evil too. <laughs> One of them was all like, now I look like him, which is you. It was then that the goddesses ordered us three light spirits to intervene. Hello. We sealed away the great magic those individuals had mastered. And there it goes. Then we flipped them off and pushed them out of a moving car. <laughs> oh no! They were pissed. <laughs> Needless to fucking say. And they set the window's background, is there? You know this magic? The gathering? <laughs> it is the dark power you seek. The fused shadow. Okay. <laughs> Dope! <laughs> cool. Oh, hero chosen by the goddesses, beware. What the fuck is the point of this? Those who do... Those who do not know the danger of wielding power will before- Never forget that- SHIT! <laughs> of all the things I didn't get to finish reading. Never forget what I just said to you. Damn it. So many chicks. Oh, oh. That was uh, surprisingly creepy for this game. Yeah, sort of a little out of place, isn't it? Now you're in the perfect position for dick sucking! <laughs> now that you're on your knees! <laughs> The dark power that you seek 
is within the sleeping Lake Bed Temple in Lake Hylia. Cool. Okay, great. All right, the lake bed within the lake. How exciting. And we'll, we'll do, do it next time on Game Rooms. Yay! See you then, babies. See you then. Goodbye. Grown adults. Farewell. Avidas and good night.